Hi everyone, it's Victoria from Kiloview. Uh, recently, many customers complained that they can't find a suitable solution for outdoor live streaming. These videos transmitted to uh, CDN are either uh, blur or uh, stock or blurred. And we found that some of them are using a mobile phone or hardware encoders with single SIM card to do live streaming. For uh, mobile phone uh, streaming, it's easy to use and very cheap, but uh, the quality is uh, very poor due to the shooting angle is limited. Uh, while for hardware encoders uh, with SIM card and powered by DC, uh, the streaming in areas where the internet is poor, the encoder cannot always perform stable. So the just uh, ask, can KiloView provide something uh, professional? And in response to such request, we come up with the uh, KiloView P-Series 4G bony encoder, a reliable and stable and cost-effective solution for outdoor live streaming. There are two members in P-Series, P1 and P2. P1 is HDI, P2 is HDMI, and that's their only difference. So today we will just take P1 as an example. Here we have a P1. And uh, let's have a look at the front panel. There is an SDI signal input port and also an SDI uh, signal indicator. Next to the uh, SDI port is the uh, power supply port, power indicator, power switcher, and a battery capacity indicator. And also uh, with built-in uh, battery, the devices can work 3 to 5 hours in the field. Uh, should you want to make it work longer than 3 to 5 hours, then we design the way mount to help you with it. Uh, next thing we want to uh, stress is the streaming button and the streaming indicator. Uh, should users want to do live streaming, then just press the button and when the indicator is on, then the streaming succeed. And also, uh, the last thing we want to talk about is the fan. And uh, it was designed to make the devices co uh, keep cool in outdoor working environments, uh, even in high temperature environments. Uh, secondly, let's move to the other panel of P1. Here we can see two SIM card uh, uh, slots and one TF card or SD card slots and uh, uh, we insert the TF card in this port then the P1 can do recording and the streaming at a time so uh, this P1 is also a recorder by the way NAS storage also supported thirdly let's look at the, the back panel of this device here we can see two uh, 4G modem interfaces two uh, SIM card indicators, two USB ports, one Wi-Fi indicator, one reset indicators. With uh, two USB uh, ports, we can either um, connect uh, any of them to the USB, to uh, Ethernet adapters, or connect uh, both of them to the 4G USB dongle. P1 supports uh, 2.4 GHz uh, or 5 GHz Wi-Fi antenna inside. So when the Wi-Fi is connected well, the, this Wi-Fi indicator will keep red. As to the uh, reset indicator, uh, whenever you need to turn the device into factory reset uh, settings, then just uh, press this button for 5 seconds and uh, the whole uh, factory resettings take 1 minute. Uh, firstly, let's look at the button and here is the uh, coat shoe bracket and camera mount. When you need to use PCRS and the camera to do a uh, field streaming, then the uh, bracket and the camera mount can do you a favor. Uh, at last, we will talk about the internet connection. Uh, designed with uh, two USB ports, two SIM cards, and the one insert Wi-Fi. This P-Series can offer five channels bonding network connection. Hence, the uh, transmission bandwidth is greatly expanded uh, so as to ensure the video can be transmitted fast, stable, and reliable. And it is this unique and strong bonding uh, makes the P-Series perfect for outdoor live streaming. Well, time is limited and that's all for today. 
uh, in the next session, we will talk about uh, how the bonding platform works. Uh, should you interested in it, feel free to follow us on www.clearview.com or reach us by info at clearview.com.